Hey guys and gals of all ages, Del Michael here for another video. And today, yes, but well, actually yesterday, well, from when I'm recording this in the mail, I got the uh, Lego January 2017 catalog. So I thought, hey, let's take a look at it since I've never gotten one of these for myself. On the front, as you can see, it's really showing the Lego Batman movie and all the sets it has. It has some really good graphics going on. So let's take a look inside. I will try at the. I'll take an in-depth look at the sets I like. But I won't really pay attention to the ones I don't like. I'll might, I might even skip over them, depending on how long the video is. And, you know what? I'm just going to get rid of the box, since, you know, I'm not going to be in the way. So, here we go. It's been a while since it's kind of a mess, because I built a logo site yesterday. Or two days ago, actually. So, um, here it is, the January 2017 ca uh, catalog. So, let's take a look. This is, I'm really liking this little poly bag. My... We really want, really want it, cause it looks so good. It's really detailed for that small thing. I'm not sure about that little piece in the middle. That might be a new piece, but I don't think it is. It doesn't look like a new piece. Um, here's the main set it's showing on this page: the Batcave Break-In set. That looks like a really good set for minifigs, and the build for the Batboat and the Rubber Ducky build is really good. They look very smooth and just overall great. The bottom corner, we got the the Batman move, Lego Batman movie CMF figures. Uh, my personal favorite is Eraser, just because I love his silly design. It's kind of funny. Um, next page, um, Riddler car. That's pretty good. Um, Clayface Splat Attack. I, that's probably one of my most anticipated Lego Batman movie sets. I love it. The build turned out great. Many figs are all right. The my personal favorite is Mary McGassel, since it's the only exclusive one, since Batman's in basically almost every set. Batmobile, not, not the only really special thing about it is the, the Kabuki Twins. Killer Croc Tailgater, really only for minifigs for me. Joker Notorious Load Rider, great set, comes with a couple great minifigs. Uh, might get that, not totally sure yet. Uh, Joker Balloon Escape, that is probably one of my, almost one of my must-buys. Fifteen bucks, you get two great, well, one great minifig, the Joker in his Balloon Escape. Great set, great small build, and just overall awesome. Catwoman Cat Cycle Chase, now, the only really special thing is the Catwoman vehicle and her, obviously, Catwoman. Penguin Arctic Roller, really good set. Um, the Scuddler, the build's pretty good, like the Poison Ivy fig. Uh, Arkham Asylum, that's a great set. I'm probably not going to get it, though, because it's really expensive, $150. Uh, comes with almost all these minifigs are exclusive, except for uh, Batman and Robin, and possibly Barbara Gordon, I'm not totally sure. But these are just a great set of minifigs. Scarecrow a Special Delivery, that one's all right. Mr. Freeze Ice Attack, that is an awesome set. I want it so bad because the exclusive Mr. Freeze is awesome. Um, um, you got some DC sets. Uh, Mighty Micros Wonder Woman vs. Doomsday, that is an awesome set because it comes with the, our first Doomsday. It's kind of weird how it comes in uh, Mighty Micros, his first variation. Same thing with Bizarro. It's kind of weird how it's, it's his first wide release set in Mighty Micros. That said, I'm not really big on the Batman vs. Killer Moth. Scarecrow Harvest of Fear. This is on my birthday wish list because it's awesome. Uh, Killer Croc Super Smash. I'm not really big fan of the set because of the builds. The minifigs are awesome, though. Except for Batman, of course. Uh, Rescue from Ra's al Ghul. It's a pretty good set. Spider-Man vs. Scorpion, that's pretty bad. Uh, Thanos vs. Iron Man, I want that set so bad. I have a couple gift cards, so I might get that after my birthday. Wolverine vs. Magneto, kind of like it, it's pretty good. Doc Ox, Tentacle Trap, that's alright. Um, the Web Warriors Ultimate Bridge Battle, that's pretty good. Um, Sanctum Sanctorum, that one's really good. Uh, then we got some Nexo Knights. Atlantis Twin Joust, that's alright. Ruina's Lock and Roller, that is a great set. I want it so bad. Uh, the Three Brothers, that one's alright. Clay's Falcon Fighter Blaster, it's okay. Jastro's Headquarters, that's not that good. 
and Aaron Stone Destroyer. I surprisingly really like this set. Like, mainly because of the build for the vehicle. I just like some of the Nexo Knights vehicles, especially the uh, Knights sometimes. Combo Nexo Powers, we won. Probably won't get that because I don't have the game. Battle Suits, they're alright. Um, Dragon's Forge, that's a pretty good set. Probably not going to be getting it, though. But if I might possibly get it. I'm not totally sure yet. Vermilion Attack, I am very close to thinking about buying that because it's a cheap set and has some great minifigs. But I have, like, three variants of Kai and kind of getting all tired of Kai. Uh, Vermilion Invader, that's pretty good. Samurai VXL, that's probably my favorite set of the wave, but I'm probably not going to get it since it's 50 bucks. Dawn of the Iron Doom, that one's pretty good. Um, Destiny Shadow, that's alright. Desert Lightning, eh, it's okay. Smaller versions of other vehicles. Imperial Assault Hover Tank, um, I got that my friend that for Christmas. ATSD, I have that set. Die Striker, uh, I really love this set. It's great shape and awesome. Uh, Critics Imperial Shuttle, probably won't be getting that. Ewing, probably neither of that. Um, Counter on Jakku, won't be getting that. Resistance X-Wing, that originally was on my Christmas list, but then I took it off because I didn't really want it. Um, Slave One, good. Uh, Millennium Falcon, my friend got that, he told me. Uh, Salt on Hoth, <laughs> it's alright. Death Star, I don't even want to get into that. Lego Mindstorms, I'm surprised that's still on shelves though. It's kind of crazy. I know they're doing like programs for it, like at school. I did one, I signed up for it and did it, it was fun. Um, Adventure Time, really want that, it's great. Caterham 7, it's really good. Uh, Beatles Yellow Submarine, love that set. Um, London, love it. Chicago, love it. And Sydney, love it. I love architecture sets, even though I don't have any. I asked for a New York one, so I think I might get it for my birthday. Um, Ecto-1 and Ecto-2 asked for that. Firehouse Headquarters, probably won't be getting that. Um, hard to find sets. Those are just sets that you we already know. Assembly Square, probably won't be getting that, though. But it's a great set, though. $280, though, so that's a lot. Um, Big Ben, pretty good. Uh, Volkswagen Beetle. Wait, wait. Slugbug. Ha! That hurt. Not really, though. Ferrari uh, F40, not a big fan of that set. Mini Cooper, like it. Um, bucket Wheel Excavator, that set's huge. I won't be getting up either of these sets. But it looks really cool because of the power functions. Porsche 911 GT3 RS, great. Um, all these Technic sets, I'm just, Technic sets, I'm just gonna kinda skip over since the video is almost ending. These two sets look really good, though. And they can combine, which is pretty cool. Um, the creator sets, um, like that one, like that one, those are both awesome. Beachside Vacation, that one's alright. Um, Park T Street uh, Townhouse, that's a great set. Probably want it, I kinda want it. Um, Island Adventure, that's alright. Uh, the Fortress, I have that set. Uh, Village, probably not getting since it's 200 bucks. Um, ATV Arrest, uh, probably won't be getting that. The City stuff a lot, we got Starter Set, High Speed Chase, Mobile Command Center, uh, Police Station, Tow Truck Trouble, um, Page, uh, Money Transporter, I do not like this set at all. The build's pretty good, but I just do not like the minifigs. This lady, I'll zoom in on her face, she does not look like a robber. She looks like she's just having a great time, and the cop looks like she's just chasing her. It looks like kind of like a scene from a pathetic movie. Um, Auto Transport Heist, that's a great set. I probably won't get it because of the price. Otherwise, if it was cheaper, I would probably get it. Since it's only 403 pieces. It's cr it's, they upped it by like 10 bucks. It should have been 40 um, Bulldozer Breakin, 60 bucks, that's all. I mean, 70 bucks, that's alright. Comes with a new hairpiece for the cop, though. Um, Sweeper and Excavator, not a big fan. Pizza Van, I want it so bad, I'm probably gonna get it. Um, Buggy, it's alright. Um, Stunt Truck, that's pretty good. Uh, from the Park, uh, uh, Service Station, they're alright. This one's way overpriced, though. It should be, like, 50 or 60. 
Um, creative building basket, creative building set, and a couple base plates or brick separator. They're pretty good. Friend stuff. I'm going to take a quick look. Uh, eh, that one's pretty good. Nah, nah, that one's alright. Since I don't have any friend sets, I'm, I only asked for one because it has a pug in it and I have two pugs. Uh, these are okay. That one's alright. Um, that's okay. Eh. That one's pretty good because it has the pug, of course. Robot. Eh. Eh. They're all eh. Except the pug one. Um, some elves, Queen's Dragon's Rescue, and Regana's Magic Shadow Castle. We got Disney Castle. Won't be getting that, of course, if it's $350. Uh, Moana sets. I love one of these. You probably know which one. Uh, Moana's Island Adventure, that one's okay. But I love this set because it comes with Maui. Maui, I want him so bad. Moana's Ocean Adventure, 40 bucks. That's a reasonable price, though. But it's, well, it went up 10 bucks because it has the big fig in it. But it would, it would normally be 30 bucks if it didn't have that. Um, Disney Princess stuff. Elsa's Magical Ice Palace and Anna's Snow Adventure. They're okay. I've got some DC Superhero Girls on this side. Machina's Tank, that's okay. Bumblebee Helicopter, Wonder Woman Dorm Room, Batgirl Bat Chat Chase, Superhero High School, and Harley Quinn to the Rescue. That's a really good set, except for the Harley Quinn build. I do not like that build at all. It looks too... Yeah. But, uh, and on the back, we got um, the... Assembly Square, and I'm blocking this because it has uh, address info, so I'm going to be blocking that. So I hope you all enjoy it, and uh, if you want to see more stuff like this, don't forget to leave a like down below and subscribe. Peace out.